my yarning friend. How you doing on this bright Thursday morning? I'm coming at you from my little corner of the world in West Texas, Plainview, Texas. Uh, it's overcast and I believe we're going to get the wind again today, but hey, that's okay. We should be used to it out here, right? But it's never fun. <laughs> I'm coming on here with a few things for you today. We made our trip to Lubbock yesterday for my husband's doctor appointment. And, oh yeah, we went to pick his computer up at Best Buy. No bueno. <laughs> no good. Uh, no, it was so corrupted they couldn't fix it. Well, that thing is 11 years old, okay? <clears throat> That's pretty old for a... Uh, it was an all-in-one Dell computer with the screen, the big screen, and then the components are behind the screen, and then you have a keyboard. Oh, I'm bouncing, y'all. Then you have a keyboard in front of you. The sound system is built into the 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 whole the monitor, and all the components to the computer are behind the monitor. Well, you know what I mean. One of those. So <clears throat> we was we were hoping that. Uh, we could pull it from the depths of computer death one more time, but <laughs> no. So, we ended up getting him a new computer yesterday. He didn't get to bring it home with him, however, because he wanted his files backed up on the new computer. And the only way they could do that, I guess because the computer is so kaput, they have to crack open the hard drive making it ir irreparable to get to the data. So we're not going to use it anyway. Just get us our goodie out of it. And <sighs> yeah. <laughs> but it's going to be five to seven days. So, But Bernadine <laughs> got her a new computer too. I needed one. But with this YouTube, I've been telling y'all, and I don't know if this will correct the problem, but how long it takes for me to upload a video. And all I had was my little laptop, and it's not very big at all. A matter of fact, I had to get an external hard drive to keep on going with my channel because it's not, it doesn't have that much storage in it. I don't think it has that much speed in it either. So I'm gonna give it a go because now I'm going to upload this video on the new computer. So we'll see what happens. No, I didn't get an all-in-one. Mine is just a tower and a monitor. And that's, that's what I needed. Something bigger. So, hopefully I can be cracking out more videos for y'all. In a more uh, frequent... Uh, <laughs> frequent... Frequency, okay. <laughs> yeah, I've only had one cup of coffee, but that's okay. I have one cup of coffee. I'm drinking my uh, water enhancer. Enhancer, boy, I can't talk either, friends. Water enhancer from the little United Store grape, and I like it. But we went to Lubbock yesterday. We hit the computer store first. Looked at some computers, left that for him. I didn't know I was going to get one, to be honest. And it wasn't even in my mind. I wanted one, but I didn't think yesterday would be the day. Anyway, so we left there so we could think about what we were going to do and what, what he wanted and how we were going to figure it all out. You know how that is. Big purchase and all. You got to look at all your options. Financially, yeah. And, uh... We went and did some other things. We we went to his... Oh, yeah, we we were spending... Two, we were in that store an hour. I don't know why. Oh, well, yes, I do. We had to wait a while, okay? We didn't make an appointment, and we had to wait in the walk-in line. So... We were waiting, thinking we were getting the computer back. Finally, after we'd been there about 30 minutes, they came out and told us... The bad news, the computer had died for sure and was not resurrectable. 
Is that a word? It is. It is, I guess. I made it one. <laughs> so, then we went over to look at the computers, and we got carried away, lost track of time. We barely made it to his appointment, his doctor's appointment. But we made it on time. And I have some clips I'm going to post in here somewhere about our day yesterday in Lubbock. We went out to eat at the Chinese buffet. That was good. It wasn't quite as good as it usually is. He got some shrimp that the texture wasn't quite right. But usually, usually, friends, that place, let me put this down just a little. Usually that place is wonderful. So anyway, mine was wonderful. I <laughs> know. And uh, so we got finished there. And uh, then we went... Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, then we, after we thought about it, then we b went back to Best Buy and made our purchases. And I had some good buys or I wouldn't have gotten a computer yesterday. Then, uh, then we went to Costco to get my husband's eye drops. And... We picked up a few watermelons, two, <laughs> because we know they're good because we got one last week. And good watermelons are hard to find, so we knew these were good. Well, we hope they're the same. And I thought my husband was going to fall in the watermelon crate. <laughs> oh, little old man trying to buy, pull a watermelon from the bottom. <laughs> Ben, I thought he was going in. Oh, no, I didn't get a video. <laughs> I didn't even take my camera into Costco, okay. But anyway, but we got we got him. Even helped a lady. He even helped a lady pick out one. You know, thump, thump, thump. And picked it up and got it in our basket. And I thought she was going to have to grab him back. Uh, you would have had to have been there, okay? But it was pretty funny, okay? You know I like a good chuckle. <laughs> anyway. I want to show you my progress on my uh, uh, poncho. So I'm going to back you up. I'm going to put you down a little bit. Oop, I hope you didn't get dizzy there, friends. I'm going to put you down here. I think you can see pretty well. Uh, okay, my friends. I haven't gotten very far on it because I had to rip out some. I crocheted on this at the doctor's office. And I made a mistake at each end when I went to put my points on. And I had to rip out three rows this morning. So... I have made progress on it. I'm just going to go ahead and put it over my head so you can see what it's looking like. <sighs> I'm going to get it straight here. Okay, friends. Let me, let me get back a little bit. Actually, let me stand up. Let me stand up. So <laughs> it's working out. So it's working out pretty good, I think. Let me get over here in the, a better light. I hope you can see that. Yeah. So pretty. I am looking forward to wearing this. This winter, I'm going to love it. I do have to tell you, this pattern is pretty fun, okay? Yeah, yeah. I love it. I love it. It's easy. Once you once you get going on it. Okay, friends. Let me see. Get your heads down here. Well, I have some sad news along with my happy news. The happy news is Lewis and I have a new computer. The sad news is I lost my phone. 
But the good news is, are you ready for this? While looking for my phone in the truck yesterday, I found his phone that he lost a few weeks ago. It was under the front seat, but not down on the floor. It was wedged up in the, up in the top part of the seat. He had dropped it on the side. You know, the big old, those tundra trucks are two seats separated, and he dropped it, and it got wedged under there. So I found his phone. My phone's gone. We looked everywhere yesterday. He he had my phone in the truck on the way home, okay? <sighs> looking up when some, uh, he was looking up some information on uh, one of the country western singers that had passed away and wanted to know why he passed away and when he passed away. And it was, uh, I can't tell you his name now. Uh, Merle Haggard, Merle Haggard passed away in 2016, apparently from pneumonia. A little trivia there. Anyway, I know he had it, okay? He had it. Where it went, nobody knows. I'm not blaming him, okay? Things happen. But we looked everywhere for that phone. It is not in the pickup. You can't call it because he turns every phone he has off when he gets finished looking at it. He'll just turn it off. <laughs> you can't find it. No. He had, he was carrying a few things in from the truck. We didn't have, we didn't have much, friends. A couple of watermelons and some eye drops. Oh, and my computer, I got to bring my computer home last night because I didn't have anything on mine that I needed to save. Anyway, I've still got, I've still got the laptop. I don't need to transfer anything. Anyway, uh, so he was bringing those items in. And I, I came right in. Oh, we bought some eggs at Costco and set the eggs down on the counter. Walked into this craft room and I'm real conscious of my phone. I don't know if y'all are like that or not. And I checked my pockets. Uh, my phone wasn't there. And I said, oh, Lewis had my phone. So I, I went out of this room looking for him, and he wasn't in the house. He had walked out to the road to chase some dogs away, okay? And then he walked back and got the monitor out of the truck and brought it in. And I said, do you have my phone? He said, yeah, and he started feeling his pockets, and he couldn't find it. So we walked out there, and it was nowhere in the truck. And believe me, friends, we checked that truck about six or seven times yesterday. I mean, under the seats, in between the seats, in the under the under the mats in the car in the truck. Mm -mm. So late last night, after the sun had gone down, I got to thinking. Well, he walked out at the end of the driveway. Before he came in the house the second time, maybe he dropped my phone out there. So uh, we went out there with the flashlight last night and walked it and walked it. We couldn't find it. I went out there this morning in the daylight. I couldn't find it. So I'm, I'm phoneless, friends. And my phone number is the one that everybody calls to contact either one of us because Lewis obviously can't keep up with phones right <laughs> i don't know i don't know friends i don't know <laughs> no but anyway again this morning we looked everywhere where could it be where 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 i know it came home with us i know unless he threw it out the window and i know he didn't do that i don't know i need my phone I, I'm one of those people that I have my phone. I don't, I hardly leave a room without my phone. If I do, then I say, oh, where's my phone? I mean, I'm just that away. I keep up with my stuff. I don't lose my stuff. I, I, I take care of my stuff. No phone, friends, no phone. So... I replaced it this morning. 
I, I got on the computer and I, I bought another one with the with the Assurian insurance that we have. Of course, there is a deductible, but I need my phone. My doctors have that phone number. I'm waiting to hear from my bronchoscopy results. I need my phone, okay? I need my phone. Ugh. But the good news is, friends, I found his phone. <laughs> Okay, this is just, I mean, you're getting, <coughs> I'm talking to you like you're sitting across the table. We're just chit-chatting and we're patty-whacking and we're whacking the patty and I'm just telling it, telling you what happened, okay? All in all, the trip yesterday was good, but uh, the doctor visit, all is, as well as, as well as it was. Maybe a little better, and he's going to continue on his medicines, and we go back in six months for a follow-up. So, basically, just to check in to make sure uh, he wasn't having any trouble with his medicine, just to see how he was doing, if anything else had happened. Anyway, that's about it. That's about it, my friends. I hope you can see me crocheting. If I'm crocheting out of frame, I'm going to be mad. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not, and I, I'm not, so I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Yeah. Well, that Chinese food was good yesterday, friends, but it wasn't good for my waistline. It's not like we go there all the time. Maybe once a month. It's not good for my diet. But that's what it is. This morning I fixed us some scrambled eggs. And I had a piece of sausage. An egg and a piece of toast. So I ate the toast. Of course, it's carbs. Of course I did, okay? Of course I did. I ate half the sausage patty and half the egg, and I gave the rest to Mama Dog. Uh-oh, that's the wrong, I got in the wrong slot there. For, no, I didn't. That is the slot. Yes, it is. Never mind, that was right. So I told my husband, I'm going to come in here and make a video and see if this super-duper computer that we brought home with us does all the things the lady said it would okay <laughs> so i guess i'll let you know on that on that front later on <clears throat> but i said okay lewis that's your that's my birthday present my birthday's in november that's your, well, he got a birthday present, but that's part of your birthday present from last month. That's both our Christmas presents this coming Christmas and any other holiday that <laughs> should come up. That's our present. <sighs> so we are taken care of for the rest of the year, friends. As far as gift giving goes. Which is fine with me. Yeah. You notice the cats are not bothering us this morning. I don't know why. Oliver's up there on that big table behind me sleeping. And Pa was in here. But she, she went back out. So that's fine. I don't need them in here. I don't need them all around over here. When I'm trying to do this. They want to be right in the same room I am. Not necessarily right up on me. But right in the same room I am. They love me friends. They sleep right by me. Pa sleeps right by my head. Oliver sleeps down there at my feet. You know. <laughs> 
Well, friends, I know this isn't a real long video, but I wanted to touch base with you. Oh, I'm going to put the clips here in the end from yesterday. So I hope you hung with me until the end so you can see them. And if not, well, <laughs> I should have put them in here earlier. I'm sorry. But I will bid you farewell. I'll put the clips from yesterday right here. And I'm signing off. My show is over except for yesterday's clip. Okay, friends. Love you. Goodbye.